Did you know that the origin of the name Brunei is uncertain? However, there are a few theories that have been proposed. One theory is that the name Brunei comes from the Malay word Baranai, which means seafarers. This theory is supported by the fact that Brunei has a long history of maritime trade. Another theory is that the name Brunei comes from the Sanskrit word Varu, which means ocean god. This theory is supported by the fact that Brunei is surrounded by the South China Sea on three sides. A third theory is that the name Brunei comes from the Malay word Baruna, which means that's it, or there. This theory is based on a legend that the first sultan of Brunei, Awain Alakbaidatar, explained Baruna when he discovered the Brunei River. Did you know that the origin of the name Timor-Leste is uncertain? However, there are a few theories that have been proposed. One theory is that the name Timor comes from the Malay word Timor, which means east. This theory is supported by the fact that Timor-Leste is located on the eastern part of the island of Timor. Another theory is that the name Timor comes from the Tetum word Timor, which means where the sun rises. This theory is supported by the fact that Timor-Leste is located in the eastern hemisphere, where the sun rises. The name Leste, which means east in Portuguese, was added to the name of the country in 2002, when Timor-Leste became an independent country. Did you know that the name Philippines comes from the Spanish explorer Rui Lopez de Villalobos, who named the islands after Prince Philip of Spain in 1542? Villalobos was sailing for the Spanish crown at the time, and he was hoping to claim the islands for Spain. The name Philippines was originally only applied to a small group of islands in the Leyte and Samar provinces. However, over time, the name was expanded to apply to the entire archipelago. The Philippines officially became a Spanish colony in 1565, and it remained under Spanish rule for over 300 years. The name Philippines is a reflection of the country's long colonial history. It is also a reminder of the country's deep ties to Spain. However, the name Philippines is also a symbol of the country's independence and resilience. The Filipino people have fought for their freedom for centuries, and they have overcome many challenges to build the strong and vibrant nation that the Philippines is today. Did you know that the name Indonesia comes from the Greek words Indos and Nisos, which mean Indian and Island? The name was first coined in the 19th century by a British ethnologist named George Windsor Earl. Earl wanted to find a name that would encompass all of the different islands and cultures in the archipelago. He chose the name Indonesia because it was both inclusive and descriptive. The name Indonesia was officially adopted by the Indonesian government in 1945, when the country declared its independence from the Netherlands. The name is a symbol of Indonesia's unity and diversity. It is a reminder that Indonesia is a country made up of many different islands and cultures, but it is also a country that is united by its people. Did you know that the origin of the name Singapore is uncertain? However, there are a few theories that have been proposed. One theory is that the name Singapore comes from the Sanskrit words Simha and Pura, which mean lion and city. This theory is supported by the fact that Singapore was once known as Temasek, which means sea town in Malay. The lion is a symbol of strength and power, and it is believed that the name Singapore was chosen to reflect the country's growing importance and prosperity. Another theory is that the name Singapore comes from the Malay word Singa, which means lion, and the Javanese word Pura, which means city. This theory is supported by the fact that Singapore was once part of the Majapahit Empire, a Javanese empire that ruled over much of Southeast Asia. A third theory is that the name Singapore comes from the Chinese word Jilinpa, which means Lion City. This theory is supported by the fact that there was a significant Chinese population in Singapore at the time of its founding. Did you know that the origin of the name Malaysia is straightforward? It is a combination of the words Malay and Asia. The Malays are the largest ethnic group in Malaysia, and they have lived in the region for thousands of years. The word Asia is a reference to the continent on which Malaysia is located. The name Malaysia was first coined in the 19th century by British colonial authorities. They used the name to refer to the Malay Peninsula and the surrounding islands. In 1963, the Federation of Malaya merged with the British colonies of Singapore, North Borneo, and Sarawak to form the new nation of Malaysia.